Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we'll be talking about infinitives. So without further ado, let's get right into it. English with Noya. So of course, before we start anything, we have to define what are infinitives. Infinitives are the most basic form of a verb. It always has the word to before the base form of the verb. For example, to walk, to run, to see, to do, to have. They're commonly used to talk about activities that are preferences, distastes, and wants. Therefore, you will usually find them being used with words such as like, love, prefer, want, need. For example, I want to go out. He likes to watch the stars. Sally doesn't like to ski. When expressing distastes, use the negative form of the infinitive by adding a form of do not, like in sentence three, Sally doesn't like to ski. Don't use infinitives with words like dislike or hate. Infinitives are also used in these ways. One, as the subject of a sentence, for example, he found out that his car was starting to rust earlier than expected. To describe something that you are planning to do, for example, we will try to see him later after work. As or after a direct object. I wanted to hear what would happen next. As an adjective or an adverb, example, he practiced every day to prepare for the cooking competition. So here is a tip to make it easier for you when you have to use infinitives. Remember that in English, we do not use two action verbs right next to each other. Only a modal or a helping verb and an action verb are allowed to be directly beside each other when it comes to verbs, right? So if you are creating a sentence that requires two action verbs, then separate the verbs with the, with the word to, and then you are using an infinitive. For example, I want to go out. In this sentence, we have two action verbs, want and we have go, but we cannot have two action verbs sitting right beside each other. Instead, we separate them by using the word to, and thus to go becomes an infinitive. You can look at the other examples to also see this happening. He likes to watch the stars. Sally doesn't like to ski. In these sentences, you can see two action verbs being separated by to. This isn't a hard and fast rule because some modal verbs also double as action verbs. And so it can be a little tricky to know when to use this tip. But through practice and observing patterns, you can get there very soon. So let's quickly recap. Infinitives are the base form of the verb and to. They are used mostly with wants, distaste, and preferences. They can be a sentence subject. They can describe a planned activity. They can be used as or after a direct object and as an adjective or an adverb. If two action verbs sit beside each other, then two should separate them. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope that you learned a lot about infinitives from this little video. And if you have any questions for me that you need me to answer on this topic or any English topic, don't be afraid to message me. Leave them in the comments as well. I love reading your comments. 
Okay, you guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe so you can get more videos like this from me in the future. Have a great day. Bye.